Recognize your emperor. My guy just pulled up. You know, shoulders broad. My favorite area in most games in general are snowy areas. I love like coastal areas like beaches and stuff, but I really do love like icy areas. Do you guys have like favorite areas in video games? Lava, forest, caves. Let me know. Uh, my word. It's rather chilly here, isn't it? Glad to see you made it safe and sound in any case. Very few venture to these alabaster ice lines, apart from Tao Hua leading the odd uh, supply corps ex excursion to gather materials. But a survey corps, of course, must go anywhere that Pokemon are found. From what I gather, Ice Peak Arena, where you'll find Avalog, is rather far off, I'm afraid. Doubtless, this mission to tackle Avalog will be another dangerous one. Learn all you can from Irida and Ottoman. Try to make yourself uh, to try to keep yourself safe. Brisk out here, isn't it? <laughs> well, that answers your question, Smalley. Irida has no warm clothing. <laughs> Even Ottoman is like, how aren't you freezing? Freezing? I'm practically sweating. You think this is bad? Just wait. This is nothing compared to where we're headed. You know, I'm beginning to think the problem between us diamond and uh us isn't a diamond clan thing or pearl clan thing. It's just a you and me thing. We'll never see eye to eye on anything, will we? I don't see how we could. As long as you and your clan cling to your vision of an almighty Sinnoh that reigns over time. Forgive my bluntness, but if being such a if such a being even does exist, it's certainly not almighty Sinnoh. Yes, yes. Believe what you want. Just tell us where we have to go. We're headed to see my teacher. And he's only ever found in one place. Which is? You're talking about that Garrick fellow, right? Where did we find him? At Avalug's legacy, obviously. Where else but a great mass of ice? Uh, what? Where else but a great mass of ice could I have meant when I said we're headed somewhere even colder? I don't know, lady. Like, why are you so snappy? <laughs> I don't know. Elsewhere, indeed. Ready to go? Yes. These two kids. Stomp off without me. This is why I can't stand people who only care about whether time is passing them by. See you at Avalok's legacy. Oh my goodness. She's a Canadian? <laughs> I mean, you might not be wrong. You got the colors on. Uh, well, sadly for me, my Pokemon don't like the snow. What is that? A Snorunt. I do love a Snorunt. I do have Sneasler here. Her element. So. I don't really want. Hey, what's up? What's up Snorunt? My boy is shivering. Oh. Get inside the Pokeball. It'll be nice and safe. And warm. Okay. Well, we can't climb the mountain because clearly there's no way across. But. Let's look around for a little bit. Oh, oops. So we got some Apom. You see some Snorunt. This thing is basically a mountain goat. Oh, thank you. It really is a mountain goat. What the heck? I'm pretty sure there's nothing over here to grab, though. But who knows? There could be another wisp, but there isn't. That's fine. Ow. I fell two steps. Help. She's glitching. Whee. White Oak Valley is the name of the area. Yeah, we got to go across um, this way.
let's grab some of these berries while we can. Crunchy salt. Why are there a palm over here? That's my question. Let's grab this stuff. So I'm pretty sure Darchi again is going to have to be the key. Oh. Oh, there's a cave down there too. Oh, could I have just fallen? Oh, is this just a side thing? I see. Let it be. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> I just started sliding. <laughs> More snow run down there. I do want to check out that cave. Shit. God. What's up, Snorrent? I feel so rude. I, I just pull up and I toss it right in its face. But we've got some sort of ice cave here. Crevasse Passage. Crevasse Passage? <gasps> what is this thing called? It's not Avala, it's Bergmite. It's a t it's the pre-evolution to uh, Avalug. Hey, what's good? What's good, my boy? You're just chilling, huh? I know. Well, chill no more. Oh, there's one hiding inside of it too. So I'm pretty sure it's just a pure ice type. So we can use Fire Punch. And there we go. We are kind of strong. Uh, our team kind of sucks though. We only really have... Darchi. And the Tax Lady. I mean, Smalley could do some work too. Like this? Yeah. We just, we just catch him, man. We gotta save them from themselves. Harvest some stuff. So yeah, this is just on the other side. Nothing crazy in the cave. But we got some Baneer. Oh, Swine Up. Alright, alright. We're finding some more Ice types. That's good, little Swine Up. There we go. Now we got a big old pile of Swine over here. Swine up. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like an alpha pile of swine or something. Ooh, almost fell inside that hole. Right. I kind of do want to. Am I trapped? <laughs> kind of bad to ask that after we fall in. We got some ghosts. Oh, is this like where frost last would be? We got some ghosties. What is that? Is that the mischievous? We do have to catch one for a lady. I'm pretty sure it's the, the haircut lady. Arizu? Oh, come back. I kind of need you. Nice, we got it. What is that? Is this breakable? Or is this an Avalug? Because Avalug is just... Uh... Oh, it's not breakable. What is it? A rock covered in ice. Touching it could make you freeze. Oh, is this... Is this where I get Glaceon? I would have to bring an Eevee here to evolve it into Glaceon. That's cool. Like, they definitely do keep a lot of the things that you can find in the main 
Diamond on Pro games in this game, which is really nice. Yeah, exactly, Fuzz. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Let's climb out. What is that? It's a tree? Ooh. Oh, we got some Snover as well. Who's... It's an Alpha Swine of. I'm not afraid of you. Toss the Pokeball first. Uh, Glalie. Ask questions later. Is it an Alpha Glalie? Level up on Samurai. It's not an Alpha. See if I can talk. Oh, there are two of them. That one's an Alpha. In the back. Oh, what's up, Glalie? Kind of big. Oh crap. We got it. Nice. Here's a tiny Obama stuff? Oh no, he's pissed. It's so small. It's so tiny. Ten sword and shield at least. Oh, you thought Glacian evolved through an ice stone? I didn't even know there was such a thing, honestly. I just remember... I can actually just poison job this. I remember, um... There was... What am I trying to say? There was a leaf stone, not a leaf stone, but like a leaf rock in a certain forest in Diamond on Pearl. And then there was like this, the icy spot as well. That's how you would evolve them back then. But I imagine that that's what it is still. I do want to catch this, this swine up though. Is it just an ice type? Level 62. I'm gonna do it. Did I was experiment and see? Yeah. I gotta find um Don't die. Oh my god. I gotta find uh what's it called? I only have two ultra balls. I don't even have the recipe for ultra balls yet. But we got it? Dude. It is a huge swine up. It's gonna be an even bigger um mammal swine when we get there. Hella easy, yeah. A little too easy if you ask me. Alright, what kind of what kind of Pokemon do we have out here at night? Here's a Stantler Driftblim. I'm expecting to find a Frostlass. Ooh, Peruggles. You're running away. Don't run from me, Peruggles. What is that? Is this baby Sneasel? It's Alpha too. Oh crap, yo. That's what it look. Is that shiny? Or is this a new one? I mean, there's only one way to find out, but like... Alright, you know what? I'm gonna save, just in case. Just in case. Oh crap, they found me. Oh, let's fight it. It's not shiny. Alpha Sneasel. Am I dead? I am? It looks so sick though. Probably ice. I think this is a like the new form. What what type is it? Fighting and poison. 
This is um guard drop. Huh. Fighting a poison, that is toxic croak, right? Oh, if this is fighting, I am screwed, aren't I? I I'm gonna I'm leave this and come back at a different time, because... That would just completely destroy my team. Fighting and poison. Interesting. Alright, let's mark it on the map, at least. Yeah, toxic croak, yeah. Yeah, this is a new this is a new sneasel um form. I imagine that that's the baby version to Sneasler, which is this. So that would turn into this. This is the Hisuian Sneasel. This one's called Sneasler. So we're gonna leave that alone for now. We'll come back at a different point in time. Um just to collect it. I love how vast this area is. I hope that they don't want to battle me though, because your boy just kind of lost his, his uh, Pokemon. I like that Sneasel better. It does look hella nice. I will give it that. Oh, here's a Haunter. Excuse me. Pardon me. Here's EV. Okay, if I can catch this, we can take it to the thing and find out. Uh, Get off the horse. Oh, shit. Ah, crap. Can you go away, friend? What level are you? 47? Uh, Smalley. He's like, lala, lala, lala. <laughs> you looking hella nasty. Yo, Knight Slash is fool. Dang, that did damage. Okay, where is the... Did it disappear? Eevee. Eevee. Oh, there you are. Come here. Level 46. Hey, don't run. Where are you going? Nice. Okay. Oh, I don't have the space in my party to like immediately go check. Just remind me to take that that um that EV to that thing. I just gotta remember where it was, honestly. Yeah, I should have marked it. Oh no, I forgot. Thank you. What is that? A little roulette? Ow. Rufflet, rufflet, rufflet. 51. Oh, jeez. Hello. It's stunned? Um, okay. I'll toss the feather ball at it. I forgot about the bird mount as well. It's not going to get caught here. I did. Never mind. What do I know, huh? What is that? Masculine. Dude, can I catch it? I just want to fight it. Where are you? I need a Basculin so I can get a Bascu Legion at some point. What do we have over here? A uh, Drifflin. Where's the Alpha? I smell an Alpha in this direction. Well, there seems to be nothing, honestly. Oh, there's a Wisp. Never mind. The trip was worth it. So we gotta find these wisps all over Hisui so that we can um 
Awaken Spiritum. Uh, at that point. Oh, crap. Thank you. I wonder because we found the odd keystone or at least like the place where I believe Spiritum is going to be. But it's so massive. Dude, can I fight it? Not this. I'm, I'm like seeing the fish in the water, but. I try to battle it. It's not working out for me. They only found that one Sneedler also. But all right. Uh, I guess we can go talk to Adaman and he read it now. Any fishies? Any? Alright. Yeah, let's make our way over here now. Oh, what's that? What's that? It's just a haunter. I get so excited, man. I get so excited. Is this her... Is this her, um, her master? Who is he supposed to be? I don't know. Well, that was a real slog fighting through those miserable icy winds to reach this desolate bit of nowhere. Well done, us. This gentleman is Avalug's warden and my most honorable teacher, Garrick. Show some respect, Adaman. Let us begin uh, with some proper introductions. I am Garrick. I serve as one of the Pearl Clan's wardens. He must be Nick of the Galaxy team. He's going to want a battle. Answer me this, would you? On what grounds? Do you come here seeking to quell Lord Avalug? He's in a frenzy. That leads to my next question. What is wrong with him being frenzied? I don't know. I genuinely don't know. And I have another question. Setting aside any orders, what is it your heart tells you to do? To quell his frenzy. Because I want to see what it looks like. Our mighty Lord of the Tundra, Avalug. Has done nothing to trouble any person or Pokemon. Sir, please try to keep your cool. For now, indeed, Avalok's causing no trouble. But we aren't aren't we also duty bound to free our people from living in fear that such a colossal Pokemon might begin to wreak havoc at any moment. We are. There's certainly some logic to that, but if that is what you hope to accomplish, then we must judge whether this child is up to the task. This fella's buff? Yeah, he's like. He's like full on, you know, gooning right now. Who cares about the grandstanding? Let's see. Uh, let's get to battling. Uh, I forgot what I have up front. But also, Darchie's dead, so I need Darchie. <laughs> Just give me a second. You will never earn my approval. If you want to allow me to test your metal, then let me just start squatting real quick. You know, let me just let me just bust it down. All right. Well, we need Darchie. First and foremost. Did I get a shiny stone? What is this? It is a shiny stone. Alright, Darchi is the key here. So we'll send him up front. I swear, if he has a psychic type up front, I'm just gonna cry. I'm just gonna cry. My masculature, masculature? I don't know. Is this hard? And what? <laughs> what? Musculature. Okay. Is as hard and unyielding as ice. That entire sentence was wild. Was so wild. That so you could break through? Brother. He just started squatting? Talking about his musculature is hard as ice? Bro. Wait a minute. I don't like this 2v1 lifestyle. Who's more annoying? I imagine... The Glalie, because it could have Earthquake. Can I... Can I do this? I'm going to kill the Glalie first. It lives on 1 HP. 
Don't die, Darcy, please. Dang it, man. I must say the moves do look very good. Why? Why do they get to go four times? Like, what is this? Can I have one turn? Okay, I can actually use Rock Smasher. That will be super effective. I love how the moves look in this game, man. They're just so nice. We definitely bring Darcy back here. It's four times effective against our bug and flying, but Scyther survived. Oh, it's level 24. I should have just killed it. That's on me. Can I agile stop? Ooh. I can just do it. Naturally, I just get the two turns. All right. Well, Scyther. Wait a minute. Fighting fighting doesn't hit a ghost. I'm sorry. I'm a dummy. I'm a dummy. I just killed Scyther for no reason. I just did it. I'm sorry. Um, Let's use Fluff. Like, I knew it was goals. But I still kind of went for it. I don't know why. It froze? Oh, it got frost bitten. What does that do? Uh, at the end of each turn, the Pokemon is hurt by its frostbite. And in damage, it deals with special moves. It's also reduced. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. I should read what the statuses do in this game. Because clearly, they're just not the same as the others. Alright, four Pokemon leveled up. That's good. Outstanding. I'm tough as an iceberg, but you smashed through. Uh, you smashed me through and through. I suppose you all can get on with it now. This one's all right. Uh, some may still have their doubts about a stranger like Nick, but I'll vouch for him. If you insist on quelling uh, Avalok's frenzy, you'll want to claim some of that eternal ice he likes and bring it to my lord's seat. Good luck. Eternal ice, is it? For that, you'll have to be able to fly, which means you need braviary. Long story short, you've got to seek out a young lady named Sabi. Tell the long story. Wait, tell the long story long. <laughs> You're not saving any time if you waste it puzzling out what you mean. Isn't Avalok one of the Pearl Clan's lords? Seems a bit odd for me to do all the talking. But fine, listen up. Okay, so this is like the the one noble that they don't give us the um, like the food that it wants. We kind of well no. Because we have to go get the other food for the, the other thing. But that's for Basque Legion. Anyway, different. Um, This eternal ice stuff can be found atop Avalog's legacy here. But to get there, you need my clan's help. Not even Sneezer can climb this surface. Let alone a person like you or me. You're going to have to approach by ear. With Braviary's help. Garrick once managed to climb nearly to the top of Avalog's legacy. I'll have you know. He says he made it to within 6 feet of the top. Might makes right or at least height and uh about sabi how do i put this even when she's not flying with braviary she's got her heads in the clouds well you'll understand once you meet her head towards snow point temple and you'll come across her sooner or later oh she's right here oh what's good sabi oh she's a kid oh wait a minute oh she's psychic my clairvoyance told me that I'd lead you on a chase. Think you can reach me? I see what you meant about Sabi. Why would she be up there? <laughs> Seems you better focus on pursuing Warden Sabi. Let me focus on my workout while I still can. 